Hello gamers, Barmy here with a list of add-ons that will keep you alive in Hardcore World of Warcraft. All the add-ons have timestamps, so browse through the video at your leisure. At the end of the video, I'll show you how to find and install these add-ons and more so that you can optimize your gaming experience. Add-on number one, Health Alarm. Health Alarm is an add-on that notifies you about several health conditions with acoustic sounds. You can set the conditions here by moving the sliders. I have mine set to 40% low health, 25% dangerous health, and 10% critical health. My sound effect is set to Legend of Zelda, and this is how it sounds. There are plenty of sounds to choose from, like acoustic guitar, Agro, 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 air horn, and even a kitten. Here's the add on in action. I find it helps me the most when I get tired and complacent. It definitely saved me from a silly death in this example. Add-on number two, High Level Alert. High Level Alert provides a warning system for high level enemies and has options to play a sound and display text notifications on the screen. It will even alert you if an enemy is flagged for PVP to keep those bastard griefers at bay. Here on the Priest, I'm chilling in Dustwood and the add-on alerts me of a red enemy mob nearby giving me time to about face and lag it. Add-on number three, Plater Nameplates. Plater Nameplates is an absolute must for hardcore World of Warcraft players. It tracks threat, debuffs, spells, and much more and displays them on your nameplate so they're easy to see. Plater has an extraordinary amount of settings and a full guide could be made just on this. However, it works well even on default settings and once you've used it, there's no going back. Let's have a look at Plater in action then. As soon as we get in range, the custom nameplates pop up. This range can be adjusted here in general settings. The first thing that the nameplates tell us is that these mobs drop quest items, shown by this icon, and that the mobs are hostile, shown by the plate colour. This colour can be changed in the settings. We sap the first bandit and his nameplate turns blue, and the sap duration is clearly shown. Now we get threats on the other bandits, shown by their nameplate colour, and we can see what spells they are casting. I land the gouge so that I can bandage. And now the sap expires, bringing the last mob into combat. This is a super powerful add-on, and combined with the next add-on is a game changer. Add-on number four, weak auras. I recently put out a video on weak auras, and I love this add-on. I think it's probably my favourite add-on of all. If you haven't got it, or you don't know how to use it, then get it on download immediately, you won't regret it. There's a link to my Weak Auras guide in the description, and this video will show you everything that you need to know to get started with this add-on. Weak Auras will help you keep track of auras, spells, CCs, procs, consumables, and much, much more. Just get it downloaded, and follow my guide, and you won't regret it. Add-on number five, Decursive. Decursive is great because it's so effective and simple to use. 
it supports all classes with cleansing abilities and configures itself automatically. It works straight out of the box. It dispels magic, curses, poisons, diseases and charms with just one click. The on-screen display can be moved and placed easily to where you want it. It's as simple as that. Add-on number six, Classic Bestiary. Classic Bestiary is simple but effective. Just hover over a mob and click control and it'll give you all the information you need to know about the mob. If there's a chance that you could be feared into dangerous territories, Classic Bestiary will show you. And you can be prepared for any debuffs or curses or poisons that may come your way. Add on number seven, five second rule. This add-on is great for casters and another super simple add-on. Its job is to simply indicate those five seconds after casting so you know when your mana regen ticks will start. And then to show you those ticks so you don't waste any precious mana during a fight. Barmy? How the f*** do I get add-ons? All of the add-ons in this video and more can be found on CurseForge. Just search for it on Google and install it. It's super simple. Under the My Add-ons tab, you can see what add-ons you have, if they're up to date, and what game client they're for. To get a new add-on, click on Get More Add-ons, and then you can either choose one of the featured ones or search for a specific add-on. Once you've found it, click on it, click install, and you're good to go. Hope this video helps you out, and if it does, please hit that like and subscribe.